Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the tutorial game, where today, Curious Simmer has a very special announcement. This dude will be appearing less because a couple of you guys have mentioned how it feels awkward and it makes editing these videos harder. Thank you for providing your wonderful insight because today we're doing another science experiment. You guys seem to really like the last one of these I did, so today I'm going to be deleting the core GUI. So the core GUI is all of the GUI you see in front of you. It's this menu right here. It's all of this stuff. And you can actually replicate it pretty easily using this line of code. Okay, surely this will work. Oh my god, we have... What? I think I might have broken Roblox. Um, um, in case you guys do not realize, I am pressing the buttons on my keyboard right now. And nothing is happening. We haven't even started deleting the GUI yet. Now I can actually delete individual elements of the core GUI using the command line. So I'm going to do game.coreGUI. We're not going to destroy a whole core GUI just yet. We're going to, and we're going to do Roblox. Let's do RobloxGUI.backpack destroy. Uh oh, we can't open the backpack anymore. That's not good. What other parts of Roblox GUI can we do? There's no backpack anymore. I don't know what we're doing. Emotes menu. No one likes the emotes menu. It's time to say goodbye. Okay, the emotes menu should be gone. Um, and now when I click emotes, nothing pops up. Can we destroy the leaderboard? Wait, I think this might be a leaderboard. Destroy. Oh, player list is gone. Okay, I can still move around though. Roblox GUI dot. Um, can we make it so you can't leave? Let's make it so you can't leave. That would be hilarious. Composer. What happens if I destroy that? Okay, there's no more composer. If you want to join this lovely list of people, then you can become a channel member by clicking the link in the description. Wait, is this list empty? That means that you can be the first one to be on this list. That means that you can be the first person to ever watch any video of mine that comes out. You will have the ultimate dibs on saying first no matter where in the world you are because you'll have a whole 24 hours to do it. You can shout out a little more. You will have access to member only dissection streams while you will be in the priority queue to have your game dissected. The first one of these streams will be on August 23rd at 9am pacific time. If you can't afford the $5 tier, don't worry because I'll still do the boring old non-member dissection streams on August 16th at the same time. You've got your reasons. Give me your money. Now. I can still move. I can still open the chat. Oh, we need to destroy the chat right now. <laughs> modules is a folder. Okay, what happens if we destroy the modules folder? You can still open this. Um, the mu uh, music menu still exists. Avatar context menu. D sure. All right, avatar context menu is now gone. Um. Okay, that's not, it's not that. Oh. Um. We can't open the menu anymore. This isn't good. Okay, we can't open the menu anymore. That's lovely. I don't know what I destroyed to make that happen. It might have been the modules. Okay, what else in Roblox UI can we delete? Drop down full screen frame? Sure, that's gone now. Oh, that might have been the menu, um, which I can't open anymore because I deleted it. <laughs> Captures core UI. Let's destroy that. Oh, we, the report menu won't open anymore. Captures won't open anymore. Music menu still works. Inventory obviously doesn't re rework. Can I still reset? Oh, the respawn button doesn't work anymore. Okay, this is so broken. This is what happens when you start deleting parts of the core GUI. Okay, let's go after the core GUI itself. I think there's a thing that's like purchase prompt. Purchase prompt app, and if we destroy that, can I not buy stuff anymore? But is it in my inventory, but I just can't access it because I destroyed the inventory? It is in my backpack, but I can't access it. Wait, I can... Oh, I can still grab guns this way. Okay, alright, I, I understand. That should um, make it so that it shows me the purchase prompt. It won't show it. The purchase prompt isn't popping up. Oh my, I have broken Roblox. Okay, what else can I destroy? Because you know, if you broke Roblox, the best way to fix it is destroying more of it. Capture manager? Nah, I think it's already broken anyways, but now it's super broken. Experience chat? Wait, does the chat still work? No, the chat does not work. The chat is broken. Let's, let's break it more. I didn't even realize the chat was broke. I'm sorry. 
But we still have a health bar though. That's not acceptable. We can't have a health bar anymore. How do we how do we get rid of the health bar? Top bar app. No more health bar. Oh, I I um Okay. Um the entire top bar is so oh gone. <laughs> yeah, I I've screwed up royally. Here's some subtle foreshadowing. You didn't screw up enough. But the thing is is I can still walk, which is not good. The fact that I can still move is a problem. And if I had the gun pass, I could probably still grab the admin gun. How much of the Roblox core GUI can I destroy and still technically be able to play Roblox? Player menu screen. That wasn't gone before it is now. Core script localization. What happens if I destroy that? I just destroyed the Roblox core scripts. And how, if I did that, how on earth can I still move? Okay, inexperience intervention app. Goodbye. I can still move. Keep getting like all sorts of errors like debouncing LSP server ML completion check becomes invalid. Um, that might have something to do with me destroying the Roblox core GUI. I can't run destroy on a bool value. No, I can't. I don't know why I thought I could do that. I don't even know what that would do. No, nah, this should be in the next, um, scripting war crimes video. True destroy. What would this do? <laughs> I could just destroy the whole core GUI and see what happens, but I want to know exactly what makes it so I can't move. You know what? We're at 17 minutes of, of recording. Let it rip. Oh, the parent property of Core GUI is locked. If you insist. All right, I'm gonna have to pull one of these then. All right, say goodbye, Core GUI. Wait, I thought the animation was weird, but I can still move. The entire Core GUI is gone, and I can still move. Okay, there's only one thing left to do now. Player GUI free cam, goodbye. What? I thought surely that would ruin stuff. Player scripts, um, player module, bye. I just deleted the player module. How can I still move? Okay, player scripts loader, delete. Okay. I see. Welp. There's only one thing left to do. That I don't think I really experimented with in my play in my previous video. 